Hey, what is up, guys? Welcome back. So, welcome to an update video. Uh, you know, Cafe Naver or 433 actually just uh, released a new patch note. Well, it's not really a patch note. It's just, um, I guess it's a dev note. Actually, no. It's, it's just, uh, it's just some random news that they decided to tease us with. Um, this is the Korean website. Basically, like uh, it's called Cafe Naver. Basically, all the Monster Super League updates in Korea it, um, is basically updated on this site first. And then it gets like translated and put over to like the Facebook and their official forum and stuff. So basically, if you want the newest news for Monster Super League, this is kind of where you get it. Um, but yeah, I actually, uh, they, they did release a Facebook post, but this actually has a lot more news. It also has some videos of the, the new stuff that's coming out. So I'm going to be taking a look at that very, very soon. Um, so... I can't read Korean. I'm not actually Korean. I'm Asian, but I'm you know I'm Chinese. I'm not Korean. Um, I can't I can't really read this, but I did use Google Translate to translate this. Um, basically, the the new update is going to be about the the super evolution or whatever they're going to call it. Um, and this is just basically you 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 evolve something um, after you get it to level 60, uh, Evo 3, you're able to evolve it even more and make it even stronger. I'm not sure if you're going to have to re-level or you just basically get the bonus stats. Um, I mean, I wouldn't really mind re-leveling, um, but you know, it would, it would be nice if you didn't have to. Would it be nicer? Would it be better for to, to work for it? I don't know. Maybe if they made it less expensive and like you have to re-level, that would be more fair. You have to like put more effort. Yeah, I, I don't know. I'm not sure if um, you're you're gonna be able to um, just buy this, or you're gonna have to like farm for it. But basically, um, they they said that there's gonna be a new super evolution. I'm gonna try to read this. Last update super evolution will guide one. The second round will announce the results of the first voting round. I have no idea what the hell that is. Um, Oh yeah, they were voting for like um, an Evo 2 or an Evo 3 version. So we're going to actually take a look at this video really, really quickly um, of what it is. Oh my god, my video my video died. I'm so unprofessional. I even loaded it first. I loaded it first so, so I didn't have to load it for the, the video. Alright, so here it is. So basically... Um, the, the the way I see this is you you take an Evo 3 level 60 monster and you're able to evolve it into either the Evo 2 form, like the, the new super evolved Evo 2 form or the super evolved Evo 3 form. Now there's going to be no stat difference between the two. However, um, they have a different skill. So if you look at the the super, it's like it's like different. Um, supposedly, or maybe it's just a different icon. But I, th I think it's probably a different skill. And it requires 30 of these in order to evolve it. Um, it's, a th it's 30 for each one. So basically, there's no stat difference between the two of them. It's just a visual difference, I think. Um, and possibly a skill difference. So you can either evolve into the Evil 2 form or the Evil 3 form. And there's no, there's no di there shouldn't be any difference in strength. But there's just a difference in appearance, which is really, really nice. Because if you guys ever remember, or if you guys have stuck with me for a long time, uh, there was this this one thing I've always wanted, like in Monster Super League, and that is the ability to like you know change the appearance of your monster back to like their evil one or evil two form. Um, you know, I was like, yeah, I, I I don't care if I'm like you know living on like Salvation Army food. Well, I'm not actually living on Salvation Army food, but basically the stuff I'm eating is basically Salvation Army food. Um, <laughs> but I will I will spend real money. I will spend real money to to uh to change the appearance of my monsters to evil too um some some monsters definitely look do, do look better like i hate the evil 3 version of victoria like it just it just looks so fucking dumb um yeah the evil 2 was so good and what else i think miho's all right like the evil evil 3 version of miho actually is pretty nice like this this actually looks extremely good But yeah, depending on if there's a difference in skill, um, we might we might use like a you know we might have to choose between the two of them. Like if you want to use the Evil Two version or the Evil Three version. Now these stones are dropped. They they claim that they were going to be dropped from 
um, super rare monsters. That so it's basically going to be like the skill books, but instead instead of it dropping from legendary, you only drop it from super rare, and you're only you're only able to get these stones from um, you're only able to get the stones from like as a as a low tier version uh, basically and then you have to like i think maybe i'm i'm speculating here like maybe you have to fuse it up into the mid mid level version and then you can you can evolve them with 30 stones so it actually might take a lot of farming like this is this might be a pretty long grind um if it's like the skill books like you have to max skill some 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 uh four star monster it's like completely impossible but i might be able to to do it now possibly um but yeah they they do look really really nice like i think the the best thing about monster super league is definitely their visuals like they they have such a great like um design team that a lot of the monsters and stuff like they they make is just so cool um not just the monsters like when they when they made the new airships like in in the new guild pv or not guild um clan pvp you know that animation like right before it starts like when the two ships crash into each other and then there's like a new visual of the new ship like if you bought the albatross like it looks really really nice but i didn't, I didn't buy the albatross but like when i fight people against the albatross it's like i'm using like a shittier ship and i i i uh you know i have to take on this like giant fortress like flying in, in the air or some shit like that just it just uh it looks really nice visually. I think the the strongest thing about Monster Super League is definitely their visuals, and this this definitely does make you really really happy. Like, um, yeah, I think I think I think they're learning. Like they, um, they they know that their strength is like in their visuals. Like I I can't say too much about game design. Like I I don't I don't I mean no offense, but like their their uh, art team is just ten times better than uh than all their other teams basically. Um, but but yeah, like the the greatest thing about Monster Super League is definitely their visuals. Um, and this this definitely looks really really nice. Like this this looks amazing. What is this? Oh, you have to choose which one you want to evolve. I see, I see. That makes a lot of sense. It costs a million gold as well, which isn't too expensive. Oh man! Oh, wait, 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 we get we get to see it. Oh dang! This looks so so cool. Holy shit! The hype is real now. Oh man! I I hope that um, in the future they have this for like all all monsters and you can like make their visuals like not look like variants. You know, this, it's mainly for my Kira. I really hate her blue hair. I just, I have so much regret about making her blue hair. But I can't take it back. Alright, so this is, this is them in battle. So basically, this is the, you know, the, the, they have a third bar under their second bar. And this is like their, it's like their ulti, basically. Um, if you, if you look over here, like they have like a super move. And I'm not sure if it's different only visually, or if they actually have different super moves. Maybe not. Maybe this is just a different visual effect, um, which is all right either way. Because there's there's good and bad for both both sides. Um, the good thing about like if it was if it was a different uh, different skill for the two of them is it would bring more variety into the game. Like if if it had more utility, it could bring more variety into the game. Um, but the bad thing about that is you have to you're kind of have to locked in to choose the one that's like more meta or something like that um, But the the other thing is like if they are if they're both the same Then it's you only have to choose them based on the visual like if you only have if you only like the evil 2 version Or if you like the evil 3 version you can decide You, you can decide if you want uh if you want evil 3 miho Or if you're a lolicon it's that that that's how that's how you decide. All right, so this is their their battle animation. I really love how they're doing this, like how they show off the the animations before they like actually release it. It gets me so fucking hyped. You have no no idea. All right, so they drop this, which is like three essences. So they they don't just drop from super rares. They drop from random monsters as well. Alright, so she got like one of her bars full. And then she has her other bar full. 
And then she has she has her ulti up now. Alright, so that's the that's the normal Miho ulti. And then this is like this is like the new one. Damn, holy shit. Ho oh, holy shit. Oh man. Oh damn. Oh, I'm I'm so fucking hyped. Like, like, like you can you can say what you want, like about like oh you know if they're making pay to win or whatever, but like, just the the animation, the uh, the art design and everything, like this that's that's definitely the strongest part of Monster Super League, and I'm I'm so so glad they're like taking advantage of that, cause like. There's so much potential. There's so much potential. Like people, people just want to see waifus. Like that's that's why we play this game. I, I mean, I mean, at the point where I'm at right now, I just I just want more waifus. That's that's it. That's that's all. That's all I'm here for. Uh, but obviously, like for people playing the game, the starting out, they they want a really nice game. It's still it it is a really nice game. But like for for veteran players like that have been farming since since the beginning of time, um, we just want to collect waifus now. It's just. It's just how it works, you know. Uh, and I, I'm really got, glad that they they did this because we can we can we can uh like we can we can make grown evil three versions of monsters back into lollies. Like that's just that it, it blows my mind, you know. It's like it's amazing. And then like the it has like a diamond like border. Like this looks so cool. All right, maybe it's not it's not that important, but like, I don't know. It just it just looks cool. That's that's all I can say. It, it looks it looks cool as all fuck. That's that's all I can say. Um, but yeah, I'm I'm extremely hyped now. Like, uh, holy shit, I need to I need to farm hard. Um, but they didn't really really release anything until like it's not really coming coming out until the the next update. Um, so it's probably still gonna be a while. But I'm I'm extremely hyped. Like I just I'm gonna start like collecting resources and maybe like you know um, once it comes out I'm gonna start farming like mad. Get all the stones. I have like three dark mihos I can raise. I think they're gonna start with mihos first and then they'll eventually have more monsters. The the monsters that I hope that I can revert back to like evil two three evil two versions are uh, let's see Victoria definitely Victoria first and then who else. I really hate the Evil 3 Victoria, I just, I, it just, I just can't, I just can't, the Evil 3 Victoria, I just can't. Um, I'll go out after this run, and then we can, like, take a look at some of the monsters that, that would be really nice if you could revert back to Evil 2. And some, some monsters would look really fun as, like, Evil 2, like, you know how I have, like, two gins? Like, this Evil 2 gin doesn't look as badass as the Evil 3 one, but it still looks pretty nice. Actually, I, w I would never waste it on a monster monster. I would I would only use it on waifus, like certain waifus, to like revert them back into their lolly forms. That's that's what I would do. Um, for nat fives, usually like most of the nat fives look better as evil three, but maybe some of them could look good as evil two. I I really think almost all the nat fives look the best as evil three. But certain Nat 4s look better as Evil 2. Shit, did, I didn't turn it off. Oh god, I fucked up. I fucked up so bad. Alright, that's it. Fuck it, I waste 7 energy. There, there's so many good monsters, like just that you can you can evil too. You can you can revert back to lolly form. There's so many good monsters. I mean, we got all right. N none of the nat fives, like most of the nat fives, look the best as evil three. Like, yeah, like Odin definitely. O Odin evil three has like be better booties than evil two. Just. You know, you got to compare the two. And then, like, Garuda as well. Same with Indra. Evil 3 definitely looks best. Siegfried as well. 
Balrona. I don't see that much difference with the Wukong. I don't see too much difference with this either. This could look pretty good as well. Yeah, I, I think the Evil One on Yoji looks really nice. She she looks more waifu like as as Evil One. Like like her Evil Three form looks too badass. Although there's there there's uh there's certain perks to that as well. Yeah, I I know I know what you all you want. You guys want the Yuki one, right? You guys want the Yuki? Okay, the Evil Three look John looks dumb as fuck. I, I'm I'm sorry. Same with the Victoria. I absolutely hate the Evil Three Victoria. Like this this looks nothing like this. Like it it looks nothing similar. It's the helmet. The helmet looks dumb as fuck. I'm sorry. Like I just I, I hate that helmet. Evil three, Hana. I feel like looks like like it's, it's uh. It's too overkill, like with the whole whole crown thing. Like I, I feel like they they just they fit too much random shit onto her. Like they fit too much random accessories onto her, that are, that are like unnecessary. Um. But yeah, most most of them most of the monsters still look better as Evil three. Like Evil Three Leo looks much more badass. I think Evil Two Vampire could look pretty good too. Evil Three Neza definitely looks better than Evil Two. Actually, I really like the Evil Two Verde. I, I really, really like the Evil Two Verde. She looks. Uh, she looks. She looks elegant like. Yeah, that's 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 the word. Hmm. Uh, Evil 3 Pixie actually looks best. All right, that's that's that that's like that's all the Nat 4 monsters. Maybe they'll have Nat 3s as well. Cause like maybe they'll have like a mix of Nat threes and Nat fours for like Super Evolution. Hey, Evil Two Beth looks pretty good. <laughs> Evil Two Beth is called Betty. <laughs> I didn't know that. Oh, Evil Two Mona actually looks pretty good as well. All right, we'll see what they release in the future. But I, I'm, I'm really hopeful. Cause like. Uh, it's such a waste with them designing like three versions of the same monster like visually they have to design three versions of the same monster and then they waste they have to waste the design of a of a previous monster but now they don't have to do that they can like you, you know they can use their maybe in the future they'll allow us to use the evil one version as well so that'll, that'll actually be pretty nice um but yeah that that is pretty much it that's that's all there is to the update uh well <laughs> We'll see what they what they release when it does actually come out, but uh, I'm really hyped. I'm just extremely hyped about the update, and hopefully you guys are too. But anyways, thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace out.